Welcome to Dpod Shorts. By now you have installed Dpod, so let's get over the configuration of your Dpod. We're going to do this in short tutorials, so if you are looking for a specific function, please scroll the rest of the playlist on YouTube to find the function that you need. In this particular case, we're going to add your Twitch ID to Dpod. First, we're going to add your bot Twitch ID. You can do this over here at the bot Twitch name. In this particular case, my bot Twitch name is called Alter Arcto. Add your bot Twitch name over here. Next to that, you'll see the stream name. This is the stream where it's going to be connected to, so the channel where you're streaming on. In my particular case, it's called Arctomian. Underneath there, you will see the O Authenticator password. Click on it once. This is the API that will connect the Twitch servers to your bot name. Next to that, you will see points name. These are currency values for functions within Dbot. We will go over this later in another short, so if you are curious about those, please look at the playlist. For now, my point names are called ARC tokens. Next to that, you will see server. This is the chat server that Dbot is connected to. In my particular case, it's the irc.twitch.tv. You can choose your own one on the list over here. They're all applied to the same value. Next to that, you'll see port. When you got Dbot for the first time, it will probably be on 6667. It is important that you either put it on port 80 or on port 443. I'm gonna put mine on port 80. Underneath there you will see stream name. This is the channel that you're streaming on. In my particular case, again, it's called Arctomian. Next to that you'll see the O-Authenticator password. Again, add the token API for the Twitch ID over here. In my particular case, it's gonna call Arctomian. Once you're done with that, you can connect your bot to your channel. As you can see, both buttons are lit up green and it shows the status online. If I go to my chat, you will see that Alter Arto is added to my channel. This might take a moment. Underneath there, you will see stream title. Here you can update your title instead of going to Twitch for updating your own title over here. I'm gonna call this one streaming again in 2015. If I press the update button over here and then refresh my page over here, then you will see Arctomian streaming again in 2015. You can also change the game that you're gonna play over here. Next to that you will see the points query settings. It will give you an option for viewers to either show their rank, which we will go over in a later short, or show hours watched, or none of the above. Let's see what I have on right now. I'm currently having it on show hours watched and I'm going to use my arc tokens to show this. The command for this is exclamation mark and then your currency value. In my particular case this is arc tokens. As you can see alter arcto now gives the amount of hours watched. In my particular case on my channel it's 12, 1233 hours. I also have these currency. This is 10,000 of ARC tokens. What you can do with your currency, I recommend you to lo look for later shorts. This concludes this tutorial.